reimagining St. Louis public schools. That's the goal of an ongoing initiative. The focus having community engagement to produce results. Our Brent Solomon is just back from the citywide plan for education meeting. Brent? And the effort began last April. They're a little more than halfway through the process. A process that so many people right here in our communities are wholeheartedly invested in. Do you know you can lie, what you want to lie, if you try to lie, what you can lie. Sixth grader artist Powell has discovered a new talent, reciting poetry. It makes sense when you ask her her favorite subjects. I love reading, writing, and audit. How can we get more students to fall in love with learning and support them to come out on top? That's why these folks are here. We have some of the top performing schools in the state. We have some of the lowest performing schools in the state. St. Louis Public Schools Board President Matt Davis is glad to see all sectors of the community coming together to help create a citywide plan for education. We've got architects, we've got uh, safety experts, we've got community experts. Even police, educators working with the public to improve school safety, infrastructure and support for the real life experiences some students have when they're not in school. There has been historically this divide, you know, us and them and, you know, they're taking our resources and so on and they're not giving us resources. Dr. Jerry Kettenbach works with charter schools but sees the need to collaborate. So they're all our kids, right? It's looking at beyond the borders of the school buildings themselves and saying what's going to best benefit all of the kids in the city of St. Louis no matter who's educating them. Be what you can be, learn what you must learn, do what you can do, and tomorrow your nation will be what you want it to be. Talented young lady there. The group will have one more meeting before creating a final action plan. And everyone is welcome. It will happen on Wednesday, March 29th. Organizers say stay tuned for the location. More information at KSDK.com.